Hello, folks. Welcome to Cudlow. I'm Larry Cudlow. After allowing roughly 5 million wage-cutting, rent-spiking, law-breaking, sex and drug trafficking, terrorist-threatening illegal migrants to come across an open border since January 2021, President Biden and his DH Secretary Alejandro Mayorkas have now decided, wait for it, wait some more, they've decided that Donald Trump was right all along. Build that wall, sort of. Remember this from just a couple of years ago. Take a listen. Trump campaigned on um, build that wall. Are you willing to tear that wall down? No, I'm, there will not be another foot of wall constructed on my administration, number one. Number two, what I'm going to focus on, and, the, and your, uh, uh, the fact is that somebody in this group written a lot about the border. Um, I'm going to make sure that we have border protection, but it's going to be based on making sure that we use high-tech capacity to deal with it. And at the ports of entry, what that's where the all the bad stuff is happening. Well, anyway, that was campaign promise. But five million illegals later, Mr. Biden's kind of slow on the trigger, don't you think? Sort of like closing the barn door after the horses have already bolted. I think they're only talking about less than 20 miles. 20 miles. Even that seems to be to assist border authorities to babysit the illegals as they cross into the U.S. But with half the Democrats in some kind of revolt against the illegal migrants' invasion of America, Joe Biden is desperately trying to put out a big political fire. I don't really believe a word of this stuff. Yesterday, the DHS inserted the following into the Federal Register. I will read it verbatim. There is presently an acute and immediate need to construct physical barriers and roads in the vicinity of the border of the United States in order to prevent unlawful entries into the United States. All right. So hold on. Does Biden agree with his own DHS that we need to finish the wall? No, of course not. No, it's all phony media stunt. Here's some more proof. Listen to this and weep. I want to answer one question on the border wall. The border wall, the money was appropriated for the border wall. I tried to get them to reappropriate, to redirect that money. They didn't. They wouldn't. And in the meantime, there's nothing under the law other than they have to use the money for what was appropriate. I can't stop that. Do you believe the border wall works? No. Well, there you go. There you go. Anyway, Mayorkas and other administrative people are harping on the need, I love this, to waive 26 federal laws, 26 federal laws, including the Clean Air Act, Safe Drinking Water Act, and Endangered Species Act, Dangerous Species Act. Imagine that. Laws. Now, the one federal law that they're not worried about breaking is the law that protects our borders by preventing illegal entries, or the laws that protect American sovereignty. They've been breaking those laws for three years. I don't hear anybody talking about that. Meanwhile, in an interview with our Brooks Singman of Fox Digital, former President Trump said, and I will quote, Biden sees our country as being invaded. What's he going to do about the 15 million people from prisons, mental institutions, insane asylums, and terrorists that have already come into our country? End quote. And on Truth Social... The former president demanded an apology. Good luck on that, sir. And Mr. Trump repeated that Biden has to reinstate, remain in Mexico and Title 42 in order to get serious about closing the border. The former president built close to 500 miles of the new border wall, and the whole thing could have been finished by now if Biden had any horse sense. Mr. Trump supports catch and deport to go along with remain in Mexico in Title 42 and a completed wall. And if Joe Biden met those conditions, things would be a lot different. But no matter what phony election cycle promises Biden is making, the reality is the Biden Democrats remain in favor of open borders. Nothing is going to change that, period. All right. Just a few pearls of wisdom.